Oh, his head moves at the front. Let's go. Let's go. Move it along. Two thousand. I'm rich. Two thousand. Are you serious? And again, that was hard. Well, oh, time to buy some upgrades from the store or whatever then. <laughs> Guess... Go back to the Hidden Beck's base now, with the swoop accelerator part. Level up. Yes? It's me. Level up him. Skills. <laughs> you could just put more <laughs> there. Hmm. Persuade. I swear she's pretty good at persuading anyway. But I'm still gonna put it in there. Because uh feats. Ah uh, yes. Oh, what level am I? I still wanna put that in there. Yes. Oh nice. Do way more damage now with my stand guns. Pistols, I should say. <laughs> Let me just give you a blast of this mid pack. What? What? I swear there's a way to get to the lower city through here. Is that not the recording room? There it is. I need to go right, straight, left. Okay, I think I can m m remember the way there. Sorry if I'm talking in quite a boring, monotonous. Is that a word? But they monotonous voice, but it's almost 1 a.m. here. And after that last interruption, I feel. Man, I was getting pretty angry. Actually, I'm pretty angry about that. Like, I pretty much explained to everyone in the house that I'd be doing this around this time. I guess it's because they're just so tired. They just kind of forgot, you know, go to the toilet in the middle of the night and just forget. That's fair enough. It's annoying though. Oh yeah, <laughs> I've done you earlier. It begs. That was so quick to get from the exit to their base. Hey, it's that again. But it's not the same one as before, though. Javier's Cantina. Oh, it's been a while, bouncer. Yeah. I'm back. Go in and speak to Gadon if. Go in and speak to Gadon. We're watching you, scumbag. Cognitive function down 20%. <laughs> Here's the swoop accelerator. Right here. You have returned. You have the prototype swoop engine accelerator with you? Yes. Here, take it. I was beginning to wonder if you would make it. The race is tomorrow, and my mechanics need time to install the prototype into the swoop engine of our bike. Don't worry. I'm a man of my word. I promised you could ride in the swoop race under the Hidden Beck banner, and I'm still going to let you do that. And I'm even going to go one better. I'm going to let you ride the swoop bike with the prototype accelerator installed on it. Without it, you won't stand a chance. Gavin, you can't be serious. We need one of our best riders on that bike. We can't yeah, let some rookie right. take the prototype engine into the race. <laughs> Why 
Why are you doing this, Garen? I have to be honest with you. There's a reason I'm letting you take the prototype engine. The accelerator is not stable. There's a good chance it could explode. It. The race. I can't ask one of my own riders to take the risk. They'll be running unmodified swoops in the race. You'll be the only one using the prototype. If you can complete the track before the accelerator overheats, then you'll win for the Bex. If you die, then one of my other riders could still come through. You don't through. care. Sounds like you've got all your bases covered. You don't get to be leader of a swoop gang if you don't know how to work all the angles. A nasty thought in my head now. <laughs> get out! Uh, certainly I'm not so sure about this. Without that prototype, you don't stand a chance of winning. And if you don't win, you can't get past to the back. None of the other riders will give her up. This is your only chance. You don't get to be leader of a swoop. I want to... I want to qu quick save. Okay, I'm ready for the race then. You can stay here tonight. The mechanics need time to install the accelerator on the engine. So you won't be able to practice your I'm not sure how I'm going to be like this. I've barely played any driving games before. Just try to relax and in the morning we'll take you to the swoop track. Well, let me save. You spent a re restless night. In the back base, in the morning, one of the backs takes you to the swoop racing pits, only where racers and mechanics are allowed to go. This reminds me of the very old RPGs. They use lots of text to describe the s the situation around you. Let me save. This is a save, right? <laughs> so you're the one who's going to s ride the swoop bike, eh? Don't worry, I've been working on the accelerator, and st stability won't be a problem. I hope. Yeah, you better hope. And I hope so too. <laughs> Get and mention that you've never done this before. You want to run for the basics? Yes. First, trying to crash into anything. There's, there's debris and obstacles scattered all over the course, so watch out. All swoops are equipped with dynamic reflectors, so hit. It will shake you up a bit and slow you down, so I don't want to do that at least once. How is your mouth? This is internal. The track also has accelerator panels. So I've got to go over them to get the best time, I think. <gasps> Can I counsel? I want to save! Each rider goes on the track alone at the end of the day, whoever posted the fastest time is the winner. Normally a rider can get away as many heats as they want, but I don't know how long the prototype accelerator and sweep will hold up. No more than four or five races, I'd guess. <laughs> so make your runs count. Gaden puts his trust in you, we need to win this race with Brezhik's Volkers, we've got a whole bunch of new recruits that, that happens, we're finished. Or do we get the race started? Thank you. Okay, be safe. <laughs> Probably fell really badly, but uh. Next Sunday I'll come back, I'll be all refreshed and everything, all woken up, I mean awake, and I'll be ready to go. I guess that's the guy I need to talk to, right? Who's this? Rundi Hadonga, Kutonga Eduam Gigi Yumalith Bang Nikotu Dolba. Kuyabi just kuna ki jawana bota ayua tahonga cha chiska dusu. Is that but no one's allowed to talk to the prisoner, Brigitte's order. She wouldn't want to hear you anyway. She's under a neural disrupt collar to keep her under control. It's dead when she looks like. Turn look at her face. It's Lily! And again, Lily's mixed race, I think. I'm not sure. Lily Black.
that's good reference to a Boulders Gate 1 and 2 let's play a <laughs> okay let's get this started oh, let me think should I do it now if it's gonna take more than five minutes to do this race I'm just gonna have to end it halfway and count to it but uh I want to race out one of my hearts that was the first run left click the mouse to accelerate it was A and D, okay, that's easy enough I think the frame rate doesn't help I wanna go faster this man I'm too badly. Oh, damn! I think that's pretty bad. I <laughs> sending of my hard race. How was that? You got the top time. You just beat races We've been doing this for 20 years. Hey, it's almost 1 a.m. here. That was my first attempt. I kicked all their asses. This is amazing! Wait a minute, I don't believe this! Look at the board! Was that pretty good? 29? I bet there's people that have got like 22 or something. You son of a... Get up there and show them it's done, yeah. So I gotta get like 28 or something. So I need to beat like 28. God damn it, I need to find a second, which I think would be easy. Damn it! Really don't need to get hit. Twenty-eight now. I think I just made that. I don't know. Yes. Yes! I got it! Two tries. Yeah, I got Bastilla to have fun with. <laughs> Through your skill and courage, you are proving yourself the premier swoop rider in Terra Simple. Great glory to the ancient gang of the Hidden Becks. Now present the champion's prize. People, hear me! Before I present the so-called champion of the Bex with their prize, there is something you must know. The winning rider cheated. You're a... You're a damn liar, Brigitte. Your swoop bike was using a prototype accelerator. Clearly an accelerator. unfair advantage. Because of this hidden Beck treachery, I'm withdrawing the Vulcan's share of the victory prize. Yeah! Who cares? Just get with me her, and she's awake now, too. You old fool! Your traditions are nothing to me! I am the way of the future! That's why no one likes you. You don't like tradition. Nobody can stop me! I might have something to say about that, Brezik. British. Again. <laughs> what? Impossible. You were restrained by a neural disruptor. How could you have possibly summoned the will to free yourself? 
You underestimate the strength of a Jedi's mind, Brezhik. A mistake you won't live to regret. Vulcus, to me! Kill this woman! Kill this swoop rider! Kill Fitting the end to this recording session. <sighs> She's gonna be helping me, right? I'm gonna so kill him. Die! <laughs> yes, Brezhik, die! This has got some double tanto thing. Yes, dead. Let me loot you. How is it going, Bastilla? Took me long enough to find you. Double bladed lightsaber. I could sell that to someone, or give it to her, maybe. Oh, he's got all the his armor set. Oh, quick save now, I guess. Uh, let, let's speak to you. Well, maybe those bloody Vulcans will think twice next time before trying to keep a Jedi prisoner. And as for you, if you think you can collect me as a prize, wait. I don't believe this. You're you're one of the soldiers with the Republic fleet, aren't you? Yeah. Yes, I'm sure of it's it. It's me and that How did other you guy. Up racing for these swoop gangs? Winning the soup race was the only way I could save you. Save me? Is that what you were trying to accomplish by riding in that swoop race? Well, as far as rescues go, this is a pretty poor example. In case you hadn't noticed, I managed to free myself from that neural restraint collar without your help. In fact, it's more accurate to say that I saved you. Brezhik and his Vulcans would have left you for dead if I hadn't... I'm trying to help you! Fight. You're lucky I was here to get you out of this mess. Yeah, we don't have time for this. Karth was waiting for us. Karth and Nasi is alive. Finally, some good news. Karth is one of the Republic's best soldiers. He's proved himself a yeah, hero he's good. Over. And he sent you here to save me. Maybe I misjudged you. Karth wouldn't have sent you if he wasn't confident in your abilities. Forgive me. Despite my Jedi training, I still tend to act a bit rashly sometimes. Yeah. Please, take me to Karth right away. Between the three of us, I'm sure we can figure out some way to get off this planet yeah. before the Sith realize we're here. The next chapter in the game. Cutscene? Hopefully this is recording for you guys. It's probably a black screen if it's not. Oh, this is what happened before, right? It is, isn't it? Four of them. You cannot win, Revan. <laughs> he can. <laughs> What the hell is his face? Oh no, he's dead. <laughs> Bastila, you're alive. Finally, things are looking up. Now I just need to figure out a way to get off this planet. You mean you don't have a plan to get off Taurus yet? What have you been doing all this time? I'm getting a little sick of your attitude, Bastila. My attitude? It strikes me that you are the one in sore need of an attitude adjustment. I happen to be in charge of this mission, if you'll recall. I know you're new at this, Basila, but a leader doesn't berate her troops just because things aren't going as planned. Don't let your ego get in the way of the real issues here. That hardly strikes me as an appropriate way of addressing your commander, Karth. I am a member of the Jedi Order. I'm with Karth! This is my mission. Don't forget that. Uh, I my never thought you'd be a bitch. My helped the Republic many times in this war, and it will serve us well here, I'm sure. Your talents might win us a few battles, but that doesn't make you a good leader. A good leader would at least listen to the advice of those who have seen more combat than she ever will. <clears throat> it's probably because I'm tired why I'm going to pick this. But since I've been with Karf pretty much since the start of the game, I'm going to have to agree with him. He's right. You won't show much leadership ability right now, Pastilla. You know, I had my doubts about this mission, but I figured the Jedi Council wouldn't put you in charge if you weren't prepared. But here you are, acting like a spoiled child. I see. It's true that I don't have much military experience. Perhaps I should not be so quick to judge. Very well, Karth. What do you suggest we do? First off, we can't get hung up on who's in charge. We all need to work together if we want to get off this rock. The answer is out there. We just have to find it. Well said, Karth. And the sooner we start looking, the better. I've already been a prisoner of the Volkers, and I don't plan on being captured by the Sith. <laughs> don't worry, I won't let that happen. 
keyboard isn't working, I'm trying to press 1 isn't doing anything, so I'm going to have to click for now, I guess. I think we'll need some help getting off Terrace. Maybe if we ask around, one of the locals can help us out. We should probably start by asking around in the cantinas. Is something wrong? You seem as if something's troubling you. That Ibn Hawk ship. Perhaps I get to steal it, and don't spoil it if I do! Something, something weird happened when we first met, like a, like a vision. A vision? A vision of what? Of you fighting a dark Jedi, Irvin, I guess. This is strange. Such visions are often a sign of force sensitivity. Are you saying I can use the force? I'm not sure. It may be that you have some connection to the force. It would not be unheard of. When we first met, your natural talent may have fed off my own force abilities. It is possible that in the excitement of the battle's aftermath, the Force allowed you to witness one of my more intense memories. This isn't the first time I had vision. The Force is complicated. Even I, with all my training, cannot fully understand it yet. This is a matter best left to the wise masters of the Jedi Council. Once we escape Terrace, we can seek the guidance of the Council if you wish. They will understand the significance of your vision, if there is any. However, I think it would be best if we all stayed focused on the task at hand right now. We can't afford any distractions. We need to find a way off Terrace. It'd be safe. And I'm stuck. The keyboard's completely disabled. What? Why is the keyboard? St I don't know, some kind of glitch. I don't know. But it's back now. Let's uh, save. And uh, okay, so that's it for now, guys. I will see you all next Sunday when I record next. Until next time. Take care and remember to subscribe if you like what I've been doing here. Good night, everyone. Cause I'm going to bed now.